Hey, welcome back to Gloom Chop. Uh, wow, that's a fancy name for this video. Why is it called Gloom Chop, Brett? Well, today we get to give in to our depression because we're playing a depressing game called Gloom, where each of us control a Victorian family who wants to have the most depression cloud. What is it called Depression Chop? Oh wait, that's just, that's just us normally. Real sad boy hours. Yeah. On this, we're each gonna control a family of four. That's a problem. Sorry, go ahead. Anyways, you got four people in your family. Okay, we each have a family. <laughs> no, I want that drink. It's gonna make me depressed if it's stuck in the crypt. We each have a family of four. We each want our characters to have the shittiest, saddest lives and then die. Cause that's like, that'd make the best novel. That'd be the best like, wow, that person really had it rough. Okay. We want everyone else's families to not have the saddest story. So I wanna make your characters happy and have nice things happen while you're trying to shit on them. Uh, we're each gonna have cards we play on top of our characters, uh, and eventually you'll kill off characters, okay? First person whose entire family is dead, the game is over. And we take all the dead characters and we add up and see who had the shittiest lives and whoever has the most depressing story wins. Okay. So, let's quickly learn about each other's families. Alex, tell me a little bit about your family over here. Sure, I got an uh, old dam. She's like a grandmother. She rules the Blackwater clan with an iron fist. The Blackwater clan. Uh, and when necessary, with blackmail, poison, and a knife in the dark. Okay, you okay. got an old granny kind of person? Just weird, I guess. I got this like pirate dude named Willem Stark. He's got a different uh, last a, name. <laughs> he's a disturbing handyman. He's worked with the old dam for decades. In that time, he's handled all sorts of jobs and relatives. He's killed people for her. Oh my god. Okay, that's their relationship. Wow. For whatever reason, there's cousin Mordecai. <laughs> just hanging out. He's just a redheaded a stepchild. <laughs> uh, in brooding is the last of his worries. I don't know what that means. I guess he's got a pretty bad life. He's like holding a fish or something. <laughs> oh, and there's a dog named Balthazar. And uh, he's called the Unfaithful Hound. Uh, Balthazar knows where all the bones are buried. Yeah. Yeah. If somebody kills the dog, you're a bad person. So yeah. Just a heads up. We got that advantage. Yeah. There is a dog here in the game. <laughs> Lindsay, tell me about your family. Okay. I've got um, Thumbelisa. She's the, dimi the diminutive diva. What's your family name? I've got an O'Toole and Deville. So they're oh, sort of all a over the eclectic place. family. Darius Dark would have been wiser to promote Thumbelisa's minute-sized head. Wait, that's wrong. Minute size instead of her mediocre operatic talents. She does have a weird sized head though. I've got the bearded man. His name is Samson O'Toole. They're, this is like a circus family, by the way. Oh, I it's think. a circus family. Yeah. You got a bearded man. Beard the beard man. Instead we have of like a bearded lady, okay. Yeah. The illustrated lady, her name is Elisandra Deville. You got a bunch of uh, tattoo lady, okay. Yeah, she's got tattoos, but she's very modest, so she doesn't want to like take her clothes off. Then I have Mr. Giggles, the creepy clown. It says, Mr. Giggles always has a smile for the children. Cool. Well, I got like an Adams Family vibe over here with the Slogar <laughs> family. <laughs> Excellent reference from both past and present. They're bringing it back. We got Professor Helena Slogar. She's like the in inventor. She's like a single mom, kind of, because her husband, Lord Slogar, is actually just a brain in a box now. Uh, but he's still doing things. He's still got big intentions for their daughter, Melissa Slogar. She's uh, it's called Cadaverous Child. She may or may not be like dead, alive. I'm kind of not sure what her vibe Cadaverous is. Cadaverous Child. Yeah. Okay. But the brain in the box really wants the best. So does the mom. And then they've got Grogar, who's just like a big uh, monster bear with a, like a looks like maybe he's got like some human brains etched. He's called Work in Progress. So they got like a Frankenstein bear, a okay. little dead kid, a brain in a box, and then the inventor lady. Okay. Great. Great. So here's how it plays. We're each going to draw five cards. You can have more than five cards but uh, you don't keep drawing if you do have more than five cards. So, you have two plays every turn. This is the first time we're playing Gloom, so bear with us, okay? I'm playing a scaled down version here. You can make any of two moves every time it's your turn. You can play a modifier. How Gloom works is we either play negative cards on these characters. Mm -hmm. You know, again, we're trying to make our characters' lives worse. <laughs> you want a low score, or you play a positive thing on other people's characters. And those cards also sometimes have effects that will play out at the bottom. Uh, there's also an event card, which don't get played on the characters, just something that happens, okay? There's an untimely death card. You play that uh, as the first play of your turn only, and that kills off the character. 
means their story is over. Their lives cannot get any worse. Take them off the board. You just gave me like a family member. There's just a sort of family I don't member. know how that got shuffled into the deck. You gave me a deck and I I gave them. you a deck. I'll give Guys, you a deck. calm down. Our life is already miserable enough, okay? <laughs> so, two plays per person. Very important that we say what we're doing, and if it's affecting a character, talk about how what happened to that character. If they get, if they get married, you know, talk about it. Who wants to go first? Alex goes first. I'm Alex just trying to goes figure out first. What, the fuck, your cards. what the fuck a money or heart icon is. <laughs> uh, okay, you know something? Oh, by the way, you can only play a, a death card on someone who has a negative score. You can't just like kill them if nothing bad has happened to them. You gotta give them a chance. Only miserable characters can die. So if we're keeping your people happy over there, they cannot be killed by something. Okay? Cool. So I got bad news for uh, cousin Mordecai. Poor little cousin. He uh, he was he was wounded by wasps. <laughs> oh no, he got uh, stung by wasps. Yeah. Not to mention being bothered by bees and uh, harried by hornets. <laughs> oh no, that's so terrible. I'm so uh, sorry is, to hear that. It is, uh, it is pretty terrible. Wow. Negative uh, so 15 self-worth points. He feels pretty bad about it. Yeah, himself. he's he's uh, he's not he doesn't have a good life going on Can there. <laughs> Just in the middle of my explanation of why that woman over there, a professor, the mm -hmm. inventor, yeah, mm -hmm. Slogar professor. Slogar. She was uh, married magnificently. Oh, she was married. Yeah, magnificently. Yes. Now, is there an effect card here? Permanently, your draw limit is now increased by one card, so you can have six hands. Cards. You would have the six cards because it's on your card. You think it's for that's me? How I, you think it's a treat for me? That's how I interpret it. You think so? Yeah, because I have a card here that also says your draw limit's decreased. Lindsay, would you like to go next or last? I'm gonna go. I wish you had dyed your hair black for this episode. The extra golf. Oh yeah, here we go. There we go, that's good. Look, I don't know what any of these numbers on these cards mean. Do you need help? Yes. <laughs> you trying to play a negative card or a happy card? Negative card. You're trying to play a negative card, okay. On who? On Which are your own character's yeah, lives? on my own self. Actually, I'll do on this On yourself. One. <laughs> yes, on the bearded man. What happened to the bearded man? He was taunted by tigers. He was taunted by tigers? What the fuck does that even mean? It was in the circus. Oh my god, that's a lot of negative points. Yeah. That's like negative 30. Yeah, so negative 30 self-worth, is that what that means? The yeah. Yeah. Well, I mean, I skipped my draw phase, so I don't get to pull any cards, so. All right, well, it's your turn. You didn't get to draw up. That's fine. That's fine, guys, okay? It's fine. I got bad news for you about Cousin Mordecai. What's that? He choked on a bone and he died. <laughs> oh my goodness. So that's the end of Cousin Mordecai's story. He's in the tomb, he choked on a bone, he got stung by wasps and then he died. A sad story, but perhaps not the saddest we will hear here today. So. What the fuck, dude? <laughs> He's already dead? He's dead, bro. I'm sorry. He died. And guess what else? Guess what else happened? Can you believe this? I know she was she was vibing about her wedding day, but then she got startled by snakes. So now she's like, now she's bumming, dude. She's got negative 20 self-worth. Bro, why is he dead? <laughs> he choked on a bone. He, <laughs> I told you, he choked on a how bone. How did he die instantly? I thought he had to like have something or something like that. He had to have negative self-worth points. To die. To die, and then he did. He got stung by wasps and then he died, and that's it. That's that it, is man. fucking bullshit, dude. <laughs> he fucking died? <laughs> he died, bro. He got three other family <laughs> You know something? <laughs> what? The bearded man, he was pushed down some stairs. Oh no, he's dead too. <laughs> Oh no, what is the little modifier saying? It think? says worth an additional negative 10 with the coin or the heart, but I don't have the coin or the Damn. heart, right. I have the bat. So if he had those icons, he'd have more negative self worth. Yeah. So people it's good to so he kill only, people when they have certain modifiers on them. He's only got 90, or uh, 90, negative 30 self worth, so. Taunted by tigers and then pushed down some fucking stairs. Now, I will go ahead. <laughs> so the old dam, she was uh, uh, pestered 
by poltergeists. Oh my gosh, That's pestered. Right. That must have really been bad for her self-esteem. Yes, it was very bad for her self-esteem. <laughs> Negative 20. Uh, and it's a immediate effect where I can pass two cards of my choice uh, to the player on my right. You're gonna give me cards, wow. I'm not sure this is a good decision, actually. <laughs> yeah? Yeah, so I'm just gonna give you these two. Oh. I'm gonna draw it till uh, I'm full here. Okay, thank you very much. It's my turn? It's your turn, Lindsay. So I'm gonna try something a Did little- Did you draw back up? Crazy yeah. here, I think. Something crazy? Yeah. You're gonna do something someone? crazy? Yeah. Someone dead you already? You got negative 10, negative 10, and like a bat, and you've got negative 10, negative 10, and a skull. Okay. Why? I'm gonna replace the top modifier card on a character with one from my hand. What? I keep the modifier that I replace, so I'm Oh, gonna... okay. Help yourself. We'll just go over here and, who, what's her name? It's P Professor Slogar. We'll, we'll take this one. She was no longer startled by snakes. So, oh, I'm playing that and I'm putting this one on her. And then it also says, if this character has a negative self-worth score, you may play an untimely death card on it as a free play. All right, so hold on. This is the event card. The event card says, replace the top modifier on a character with one from your hand. Okay. So then I was just gonna kill her. So then you're gonna, what happens to her? She, what does it say? Died, died without, without cares. cares. That actually means she didn't have any negative points. She died completely neutral. Yeah. She died without cares. So she lived a pretty decent life. It says we should all be so lucky. So you completely negated her story. Mm -hmm. It wasn't, it was completely meaningless. Wow, that's pretty rude. That's pretty, pretty. And then that's it for me right now, I just fill up. I don't know why you attacked me. He's the one that pushed your guy down the stairs, and then you came at me swinging. Well, he was kind of sad dying, so that worked out for me, I guess. We'll see about that. We'll see what Bring happens. Bring him back to life and make him really happy. We'll see, yeah. How, guess what happened? Guess what happened to the little girl, the little cadaverous child? She was cursed by a crone. Oh no. That's negative 15, negative 15? Are you freaking kidding me? Not only that, guess what? The teddy bear got written out of the will. He was written out of the will, negative 20 points. They said, we're not gonna give anything to that fucking teddy bear monster with a brain inside of it. What Damn. are you, what are you, simpleton? And I gotta skip my draw to face this turn. Mm -hmm. it cost me a lot, so don't fuck with me, guys. That's pretty, two pretty sad things that happened. Yeah. Tragedy. Yeah. Sorry. <laughs> but don't, say? don't worry, dude, because the teddy bear yeah. landed a legacy, dude. Look what? at this. What? Yeah. Oh, wait a minute. Now, what is this? Go for oh, it, dude. What? Wow. Landed a legacy, mm -hmm. and it just completely undoes the negative I, uh, negativity yeah. I was feeling. I got you, dude. That makes and you me can mad. Draw, you can draw two <laughs> cards. That makes me mad. Oh, thank you. Yeah, for you get two cards now. Cards. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, also. Yeah. Yeah. I got bad news. You got bad news mm -hmm. for me? Mm -hmm. Okay. Well, at least nobody can die. So, Balthazar, the dog, stole from a stiff. He stole from a stiff. That's right. Balthazar uh, robbed somebody. Am I supposed to question it? <laughs> I don't know. He stole from a stiff, dude. He stole, it's, he stole, like, he took a bone from a dead body, dude. Lindsay, is it your turn yet? I hope some bad things happen to your family. Yeah, this, um, the creepy clown, Mr. Giggles, yeah. mm -hmm. he was distressed by dysentery. He's got diarrhea, dude. He's like, Distressed by dysentery. Wow, that's yeah. nutty. And so the player to my left randomly select and discard two cards from my hand. And I don't want to know the details. Oh. Oh. Goodbye, two cards. <laughs> Do you get to look at those? It says, yes. I don't want to know the details. You don't want to know the You don't, actually. That's true. Um, you don't want to know. Choose an untimely death card from the discard pile and then play it on a living character that either has the heart icon or the negative self worth score. You get to choose from the what? I get to take a negative or death untimely death card from the discard pile. Okay. Then play it on a living character that either has the heart icon or negative self worth score. And I'm just gonna go ahead and kill my clown. You're gonna just kill your clown? Yeah. He's got negative You think 30 35. was enough, huh? 25 I mean. He has negative 25. I'm really happy for you. Wow. I gotta kill my guys before you can give them good lives. We'll see. <laughs> That's uh, the that's strat, huh? Yeah, that's my strat. He, he suicided. No, he was badly burned. Oh, well, still. After he shit his pants, probably. Wow. That's pretty fucked up. Uh, the brain, the brain in the box. Nothing happened to him, actually. The teddy bear, the giant teddy bear, 
Sure, he he landed a legacy, uh -huh. but guess who didn't like that? Who? The Catholic Church. Oh no! In fact, they actually chastised him uh, about inheriting a legacy. Um, he's not supposed to do that. You're an abomination. So he got like negative twenty five self worth. So my draw limit is decreased by one card currently. But guess what else? What else? <laughs> you know who was burdened by boils? The little girl. She was burdened by boils, dude. Okay, she's having a rough time. She's not feeling very burdened good at all. Burdened by boils. Burdened. And give one card of your choice from your hand to the player on your right. Here. Enjoy. Wow, what a sad story for this poor little girl. <laughs> the, uh, the tattooed uh, mm -hmm. individual. <laughs> Alessandra. They, um... Um, uh -oh. had a, had a, uh, I mean, they were wondrously well fed. Oh. Oh, wow. Yeah. Getting taken care of. She actually has tattoos of food and stuff. You just can't see them because she's always like, she loves food. And that makes sense. She's always covered up. Yes, yes. Unfortunately for Willem Stark. <laughs> yeah. He, uh, he suffered from some serious sores. Oh, no. Um, that's pretty sad. Yeah. I mean, it, it's a little sad. Not as sad as some stories I've heard. He course, definitely but. suffered from some serious sores. Uh, let's go ahead and draw a card. One card, because it decreased my limit by one playing that. Apparently, you are a sore loser. That's what it said. Hmm. Got, I've got some good news for the, the bear, the oh. leg, legacy bear. I don't think so. I don't think you have good news. Who? I don't think that's true. Uh, you know, the church condemned, but you know, he was diverted by a drink, so he's feeling okay about it. And I got a- What? He was diverted by a drink? What the fuck does that mean? It means a little diversion goes a long way, Brett, okay? Look at that. Stop! So I need to discard a this card. This bear is having a good life over there, dude. This bear is having the best life. I'm hating it. I don't like it. No, I don't think that's, I don't think that's how no? the story will end. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Guys. <laughs> I got bad news. Got bad news. Guess what? I know we were all getting attached to the cadaverous child, but she was baked into a pie, tragically. Tragically. She, with all that negative bad history, she was baked into a pie. Dead, but delicious. So. You hate to see it happen. You hate to see it happen. You hate to see that happen. Gosh, that is so true. Now what I would like to do, I will be drawing one card from each opponent's hand. Oh, it's an at event. random, huh? As an event. My greedy little paws right here. And uh, I'm gonna take uh, the back end here. Oh, the one that actually has something in the middle, of course. Nice, dude, I like it. That's kind, of, like that's it. kind of hacks. Uh, well, some bad shit going on here for uh, for for the old dam. Death becomes you, hurry it up. Oh no, what is this? She grew old without grace, which is true. Grew old without grace. I don't like all those negative modifiers. The player to your right may randomly select and discard two That's cards me. from your hand. No, I'm to your left. There you go. I will now draw up to four cards. Wow. That's right. I think we need to make sure this old bitty doesn't die with all that negative self-worth. I would hate to see a story end that way. All right, Lindsay, what do you got? This little <laughs> doggo. <laughs> This little doggo, Balthazar, was you know pouncing around, and mm -hmm. then he was uh, magically blessed by the bishop. Blessed by the bishop. So he's you know plus twenty. Oh, oh good. thank goodness. That Love is life. fun. Bless, bless up for the doggo. And the card says What's to discard up? as many as I want and draw up to what does it say? Draw up to something. Draw up to your what? Your draw limit. <laughs> Okay, so I want to play this, and I want to know if your guys' thoughts on how this is supposed to work. Okay. Choose one living character from a family of your choice and remove it from the game. Then remove this card from the game. So does that mean that it doesn't count towards their entire story? They just dis what, what is the name of this card? It's called Imaginary Friend. <laughs> yeah, it deletes them from existence, I guess. Well, it's either going to be the old dam or uh, the, the little girl, so. The little girl's dead. She's dead? She's dead, I killed her. She was oh, baked into dead. a pie. Oh, she's dead, then you know what, it's gonna, that's right, I forgot that. It's, it's probably gonna be the old dam then. You fuck. <laughs> yeah. Wow, the old dam actually was never real. 
Her and story then, was just a figment of someone's imagination. Intense. <laughs> Bro. <laughs> You're done? <laughs> That's fucked up, Lizzie. Okay. <laughs> what the fuck? What, you want me to not play it? I got two living characters. You fucked me on this, so, and then you fucked him. I'm, that, for him, I mean, I guess that was about the same. When you gave my character a carefree life, Wait, you might also... as well have removed them from the game. What? Okay, yeah, I had to be living, okay. Yeah, no, no, no. We shall not delete the annals of history. I'll remember that. <laughs> I remember my stacked grandmother I've been given the worst life to is now imaginary and removed from the game. <laughs> That's some fucking bullshit, dude. <laughs> she was gonna, I was even gonna have like a fucking modifier death card so she'd have even more consequences. What's going on with this? Oh card? man, guys, I got a bunch of bullshit in my hand, dude. Okay, Lindsay's got two fucking characters. All right, Lindsay, mm -hmm. I got news about your clown. Your clown's having a pretty good time. Things are about to get better because they slept without sorrows. My clown is dead, dude. What? I meant the illustrated person. Can you move your dead people slightly out of the way? Currently, here, put your living people just there you go. Okay, I'll do the same. These are my two living people. I meant the illustrated person. I'm sorry. I did not mean that dead clown, RIP, rest in peace. The illustrated woman slept without sorrows last night. No worries. Positive 10. A good night's sleep without being sad. Okay? And then guess what? And then what? It's important that we all have a chance at a fresh start. So I would like to offer uh, William Stark a chance to begin again and to discard all modifier cards on one living character. Good news, this is your big chance. You are a fresh face in this world, okay? So we got I mean, Are you guys teaming? You're teaming. I just, look, she's positive, dude. That's gonna hurt her, man. You gave me neutral, I gave you neutral. Bro, I have three fucking characters. <laughs> How am I even supposed to win, like, realistically with three fucking characters? <laughs> One is already. And you guys are fucking removing, like, effects, all, like, all effects, and... <laughs> all right, Lindsay? <laughs> what? Who is this fucking person? In... Oh, your crow? Ooh. Your situation with the crow over here? Yeah. Or oh, not the crow, I'm sorry, you're, uh... The bearded man, you killed him off. Yeah, he's dead. Here's the thing, Lindsay. I went to the fucking pet cemetery, and I'm gonna res that motherfucker. <gasps> Shit. Yeah, what is oh it? What's shit. the name of the card? Oh, it's called a second chance. A second chance. A second chance. You is brought this an someone? event card? This is an event card. Fuck yes. you. What are you playing? I Cancel and discard an event card What's as the, it's played. The name of your card? It's called Smoke and Mirrors. And it cancels his event card? Bro. <laughs> and you just play that whenever. It doesn't take up your turn. It doesn't take up your card limit. This is some fucking <laughs> bullshit, dude. This game is so fucking dumb. I'm not we all know who's gonna win. Who? You. <laughs> Why? Because I barely have like he negatives. He has neutrals. He has one person that died. One fucked up dead person, that's true. Okay, that was your one move. What's your next move? Do you have any cards left? <laughs> Can you draw? <laughs> Dude, like. You have an empty hand? What's going no, on? No, I don't have an empty. Relax for a second, <laughs> dude. I didn't think she was gonna pull that out of her ass. <laughs> okay. What the fuck, man? All right, I'm yeah. just gonna I'm just gonna put Balthazar in a prison here. <laughs> What's the name of the card? <laughs> it's in a prison. It's called. It's just it's just called was put into prison. That's mm. the name of the card. Okay, your dog went to jail. My That's... dog went to jail to hopefully cancel whatever the church blessed him with, because <laughs> that was really fucking op. And I just, I don't know, I'm gonna just draw my cards here, cause. Oh my goodness. What the fuck, man? Wow, that's nuts, dude. That's fucking crazy. Okay. Okay. Who do you got alive here still? Dude, I got a brain in a box and I got a teddy bear who's a very complicated life going on here, okay? Yeah. Well, guess what? This brain in a box, it was popular in Parliament. What? <laughs> yeah, dude. <laughs> popular in Parliament? That just, that doesn't, you. Ugh. This is a, this has been a tragic misunderstanding. I hate to say it. It's been a tragic misunderstanding. I'm sorry for the confusion. The brain was supposed to be in jail, okay? And actually, the dog was what who everyone loved in Parliament, okay? Okay, the brain was supposed to be in jail. That's it. I played this card called A Tragic Misunderstanding. I switched the top two the modifiers of two living characters. I belong in jail. I'm sorry, doggy, you're free. And you're beloved oh, by Parliament. Oh, dude. <laughs> well, 
It's okay, because what else happened? What else happened? It's been very, very busy. You know what? But the teddy bear is the thing with the teddy bear. He broke many bones. He's kind of a prototype, and that happens sometimes. So he broke many bones, trying to just live in this world. That's, you know, shit happens. Oh, I just realized I can no longer play event cards as long as this fucking stupid modifier is here. So that sucks. I should learn how to read. All right, my turn is over, but pretty sad all around here. Alex's Feeling good. turn. Uh, okay, so I understand there was a misunderstanding at Parliament. Yeah, yeah, but, yeah. But regardless, <laughs> Balthazar was uh, was crippled by creditors. Oh no! How did he even get creditors? He was registered in Parliament, oh. and they realized that he uh, he he's overdue taxes. <laughs> by far, he's down. never paid his taxes. Oh my god, that's so sad. That is pretty fucking sad, man. Mm. It is pretty fucking sad. Everything about all of this is sad. <laughs> That's the dog, huh? Mm. Now, uh, what's your situation with the tattoo lady? Turns out, um, uh -oh. she's, she's pretty good at cards. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Dang. She's living her best life, I living guess. Living her best life. That's it. That's it for me. <laughs> so. I'm just fighting to keep the dog down, dude. I don't know. The great thing about the dog, though, is this, he was delighted by ducklings. This is. Oh, he saw some ducklings. Draw one card for each duck. There's one duck. Nobody else is a duck, right? Okay. The thing about what lady is she? Um, lady was, is she was scarred by scandal, so she put that negative. She point. was scarred by yeah, scandal. She has negative how much? Twenty-five. Um, yeah. What the fuck? But I mean, she still got, also got plus 20 and plus 15, so really oh. she's still ahead. She's a net positive. What the fuck is? Still okay. Positive. And uh, I have to discard my entire hand because the truth hurts. That's great. And then my turn is over, so. Wow. Very cool, everybody. How about this, though? Mm -hmm. What about this little tiny person? We never hear anything about this tiny person living her life. You never see her, really. She's just always like, mm, tiny. You can't see her. But I heard that she was charmed by the circus, you know? Actually, well, she was... She, she is the circus. She's part of the circus, and she's like, I love my job. I love being here. I'm thoroughly charmed by these events. And then guess what? Are you ready? Mm -hmm. Oh, I fucked up. I played the cards in the wrong order and cucked myself. Yeah. And I fucked up. That's a misplay. Been there, done that. It's, dude. Going, it's going on the list of misplays. You hate to see it happen, but there it is. It's okay. It's okay. You know what? It's O. Oh, it's not okay. It's actually not okay. Mm -hmm. It's not okay. <laughs> uh, it's not. I'll, I'll just pass. I'll just go. I'm going to go ahead and pass my turn. That brain situation you got going on yeah, over yeah, there. Yeah, he, uh, yeah, yeah. Turns out he. Uh, found fame at a feast. He found fame at a feast, you say. Oh, very oh. cool how it negated all negative points I had. Uh, okay guys, the dog. Yeah, dude, mm -hmm. the dog, tell me about the dog. The dog was greeted by ghosts. Oh, scary times. I love this stack of clear coat on this fucking dog's yeah. life here. <clears throat> um, well, I'll just tell you all about uh, this teddy bear. They're gonna be all right, because they found love on the lake. Found love on the lake. Wow, a very positive thing you've given Plus me there. 30 there. That's very cool. Plus 30 there. Very cool. And, um, very cool, I love it, I love to see it. And, uh, okay, so, um, the, here's, here's what I guess. Stop. It's confusing, because I'm yes. gonna, um, Played this card, and damn, I guess. Bro, my food is getting cold. Yeah, man. Lindsay, can we? Uh, <laughs> wait, you're playing it. What does it say? It says my draw limit is decreased by one card. No. You read, oh, sorry. Read the card. Oh, I was plagued by the pox. Plagued by the pox. Mm -hmm. Some very negative attributes you've got there. I see so it. decreased by one, so I can only pull one card, and my turn is over. I guess. Cool. Uh, guess what? For, I can't even tell what character that is. That's the illustrated woman? Yes. You know, it's a, it's a ups and downs in life, but ultimately the illustrated woman was slain by an heir. Slain by an heir. So that's a plus 10 to that life story. Worth an additional negative 10 with the coin or the heart icon. So that's negative 
Yeah. You got a, you got a coin on that? Yeah, that's a, the top So that's one. what, zero? It's zero. We yeah. zeroed it out. Zeroed out. Not a sad story, not a happy story, just a just a neutral. Very cool neutral we've got here. Oh. Um, and then while we're at it, I know, listen, you found love on the lake, but love, it comes, it goes. Turns out, actually, he was widowed at the wedding. So as it turns out, that love, pretty short-lived, so. Listen, guys. What? Could Things be. are happening at a rapid speed here. Uh, the lady, the tiny lady. Mm -hmm. Listen, she uh, she was the toast of the town. Okay, nice, dude, the toast of the town. <laughs> the cards don't <laughs> line up. <laughs> Currently, a positive of what? Twenty-five. What does that say? Fifteen. 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 Mm -hmm. Positive of fifteen. That's great, dude. Also, the dog. Yeah, the dog. Time with this dog. Was burnt by the mob. The burnt? Dog, the dog died. Burnt by the mob, no! This is a uh, ultimate death card that can be played on the second play. So, <laughs> dog died. Oh no, dude. Someone finally put that, put that dog out poor mutt to rest. Yeah, I understand. Okay, so Ooh, my turn, huh? It's your turn, Lindsay. <laughs> it's your turn. Okay. My little thumb lady. She was starved in the storm. Starved in a storm, huh? Yeah. Wow. Thumb lady, starved in a storm. Okay. Then the hits and just keep on coming. She was also beaten by beggars. What? Oh, she lived. <laughs> she lived. No, she, she lived. lived. She just okay. was also beaten by beggars. So, yeah. So beggar. I'm gonna go ahead. And you really just have like. I mean, it's only one person in your family that's alive. Yeah, she's going through it, I guess. Um, here's the thing. Here's the thing you should know about the brain in a box. He was, he contracted consumption. You would think that it's impossible actually because he's actually just a brain in the box, but he found a way. He found a way to get a little sicker. And then it was a dark and stormy night. And on that dark and stormy night, I draw four cards and play any one card as a free play. And then I discard until I reach my current draw limit. Can I, you think I can stack this? You may play up to, so this is, I can play any card as a free play. And then this card says I can play up to two additional cards this round. Like why, I could, right? If that's, why not? What is that? Okay, and I'm playing Misfortune Favors the Old. You may play up to two additional cards this round. They may be any combination of untimely deaths and modifiers with negative self-worth points. Whew. So, with that in mind, I have I fucking hate this. I fucking hate this game. <laughs> okay, okay. Wow, I actually have to like look deep through the layers of card too to see there's a negative, there's like a plus 15 hidden way down there. Yeah. Yikes. <laughs> I'm gonna, uh, fell down a well. The uh, bear also fell down a well. Okay, that's negative 10. Shit happens, right, folks? <laughs> Shit happens sometimes. Sometimes you can't. It can't be helped. And then um, this character died old and alone. The bear died old and alone. That is what happened. Wow. Died old and alone. Just a bear. Died old and alone. I have one living character. I think we all have one, one living character. We all have yeah. one living character. Wow. Uh, let me now play this out of order here for a second. So <laughs> I'm just gonna listen. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> William Stark. He was pierced by porcupines. That's oh. how he woke up that day. Oh no. He then proceeded to, um, well, I guess just bluntly put, he was uh, mauled by a manatee directly afterwards. Okay. He survived. Man. He has to live with that. You survive, man. Damn. Skip yeah. your draw phase this turn? Yeah. What does your top one say? Your draw hand? Oh, it's limited by one. I can only have four cards currently. What's underneath that one? What? Oh, I see. Mind your business. What? I just need to know. Why? You about to revert history again? I'm gonna... Yeah, those event cards fucking suck. <laughs> <laughs> I hate it. Yeah, I'm gonna choose one living character and discard its top modifier card, and that's it. That's wow, the one. pretty, pretty fucking cute. And then I'm gonna uh, play this on my guy. It's just, <sighs> they were shunned by society. They were shunned by society. Yeah, and huh? I have to discard my entire hand and skip my draw phase. <laughs> okay. Now I've got nothing, it's your turn. 
So that's good. She can't do anything to us. So really going all out on this one. Let's let's enjoy that. She's for trying a to moment. go all out. You wanna you wanna enjoy it for a moment? I have nothing to enjoy <laughs> here. It's Brett's turn. I'm gonna end it on my turn. You're dude. gonna end it on your I'm turn. End it all. I yeah. want you to think about in before you end it on your turn. Okay. Otherwise, I'm gonna skip my turn for whatever this fucking <laughs> situation you got going on here. All right, is. listen. The, the 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 brain in the box. He was ruined by rum. Ruined by oh. rum. He's got a drinking problem, and I have to skip my draw phase. And guess what? This little tiny baby we're also worried about. She had a picnic in the park. And made you know what she felt a lot better about that picnic in the park. Okay, okay, great. That worked out great for me. Okay, cool. Yeah. You're gonna end it. I don't I'm think you should it. end it. I don't think you should end it. I don't have a choice, dude. What if she? Okay. He's dead. <laughs> <laughs> what happened? What does it say? He died of despair. He died of despair. Okay. Here's the bad news. It's the end of the game. And here's the. This is the bad news. The end of the game. <laughs> The game ends the instant the last character in any family dies. Add up the visible self-worth points of all your own dead characters. Of all the dead characters. Only the dead characters. Okay. So we do a little math here and look all the way through. Okay. Right. How many negative what's your what's your Ne hopefully negative score. What's my negative legacy? You want the lowest mm -hmm. points possible, right? Mine's negative 55. Interesting. Mine's negative 85. Mine's negative 65. Ooh. You Look had the that. saddest tale. I had the saddest tale, which, to be honest, we had a grandmother. Turns out everyone was schizo. She didn't exist. <laughs> the dog bad. got burned by a mob. <laughs> This guy died of despair. Uh, the the cousin choked on a chicken bone literally in the first turn. You, just, you killed him. He choked on a chicken choked, bone. Bro. And then the other guy died of despair, which totally makes sense because everyone else in his life uh, suffered great consequences. Yeah, I love that dog. Huh? His dog got burnt by a fucking mob, dude. How, how would you feel? Yeah, pretty bad. You fucked me on this, and then you fucked him. Hey guys, whoa, what's in here? Another great video. Thanks for watching this episode. Make sure to check out some of their stuff we got going on in here, as well as uh, over here in this section. Oh, did you check out the description? We got new merch. Uh, drop it in hot. Go pick up some cool shirt for your back to school season uh, wear. Change up those outfits. Get, get those kids to be asking you, hey, what's that logo on your shirt? And you say, it's cow chop. They say, what's, what are you talking about, dude? And you say, it's a YouTube channel. And they're like, oh, you're a fucking big nerd. But hey, you know what? I'm rocking this right now, feeling pretty good. And we'll see you on the next video. I don't know why I keep doing this. <laughs>